burned. Instead, it was the cause. All of a sudden, just lit up on fire everywhere. Brett Sigworth says he applied his sunscreen, and then, seconds later, his body was engulfed in flames. Sprayed on the spray on sunscreen, then rubbed it on for a few seconds. And I walked over to my grill and uh, took one of the one of the holders to move some of the charcoal briquettes around and all of a sudden it just went out my arm. In these spray sunscreens there is oftentimes a very high alcohol content so that alcohol can be very flammable. I went into complete panic mode just screamed I mean I've never I've never experienced pain like that in my life. It was this Banana Boat Sport aerosol sunscreen that Sigworth says caught fire on his body. Just the way it burned, it went wherever the sunblock went, that's where it burned. These pictures from the hospital burn unit show the extent of his second degree burns on his chest, his ear, and on his back, you can see the lines where he sprayed the sunscreen. No warning that says this product's flammable when applied to your skin. The warning label reads, flammable, don't use near heat, flame, or while burning, but nothing about once it's applied. In a statement to CBS2, Banana Boat says it's taking this matter seriously and adds, aerosol products should only be used as directed on the product label, which cautions against using in the presence of flames, heat, or while smoking. So if you were to use it, then you have to wait, rub it in and wait before you'd go anywhere near a fire. And that's, you know, cooking with a barbecue or going to, you know, make your eggs even on a stovetop. And that's why Sigworth is going public to prevent this from happening again. I had no idea and it was so scary and I just wouldn't want to see it happen to anybody else. Food and Drug Administration is investigating this complaint and advises consumers to be cautious and report serious events.